Hey, what's up there everybody? My name is Davius Beck, and I'm back with another tutorial course to discuss all the different ways that we can use Bitwig with external hardware. I'll be using a lot of different hardware, everything from my Octatrack to my Analog Rhythm to my little Craft Synth, uh, also the uh, Zero Coast from Make Noise. Uh, there's a lot of different stuff that we're gonna be utilizing throughout this course. So let's check out how we can take advantage of Bitwig and the native devices to really breathe some new life into all of this gear. Throughout the following course, we'll be learning about how we can use Bitwig with various types of external hardware. Utilizing dedicated hardware, such as samplers, synthesizers, and sequencers, can give us a very unique sonic palette. Using these alongside a DAW gives us that much more flexibility when it comes to automating and manipulating certain parameters. So combining these two worlds can give us that many more creative possibilities. That's why we're going to explore how Bitwig can help us take advantage of hardware that we might already have laying around. There's several different native devices that we can utilize in Bitwig to communicate with our hardware, and whether it's hardware that just receives MIDI or hardware that can respond to control voltages and gate messages, we have something that allows Bitwig to communicate with it. So, with that established, we're going to start looking at some basic examples and uh, integrate some of our hardware into this lovely program. <laughs> 